Happy Halloween and welcome to episode number 169 of Our Young Creators, the podcast. To commemorate this special day, I wanted to give you a treat. I went back into our training vault and pulled out one of our most frequently asked questions. And this question has to do with investing in my business, why I do it, how I've reframed it, and how you can do the same in your business. Now, on the day that I recorded the training, we did experience a number of technical issues, which means that the audio portion of the podcast is not as good as we normally have them. However, because I got asked this question recently, I wanted to pull this out from the vault because it's that important and I wanted you to hear how I explain to people why I choose to invest in myself, my business, and also in my kids. If you have takeaways from today's episodes or any ahas, please come tag me or DM me over on Instagram at Our Young Creators. Enjoy. What began as an experiment to bring my 11-year-old daughter into my business has evolved into our young creators. A podcast, a training center, and a movement dedicated to equipping kids with real-world marketable skills so that they can fund their own brighter futures. We're here to inspire you to turn consumption time on devices into creation time and use technology as a tool to bond and not bicker with your kids. Join us each week as we share the inner workings of our partnership and bring you stories from guests of all ages and from all walks of life on our quest to nurture and to celebrate our young creators. I am so excited you are tuning in today because today's question is something I get asked a lot. Why do I continue to spend money and make investments in myself, in my business, and for my my kids? And it is such a great question. The first thing I want to clarify is this that when we are spending money, I never see it as the money is spent and it's gone. I always see things as an investment. Some things, of course, are better investments than others, but anything that I choose to invest in, whether that's a coach, a coaching program, activities for my kids, things I do for myself, like yoga classes every week, those are investments. I am investing today and depositing into my future self, into my business's future success, into my kids' future selves. Everything is an investment. If we think about money in terms of investing, That's a really great way to look at it because it no longer feels like it's something icky or something we don't want to discuss or look at in our family. Earlier this morning, I had the great privilege of hosting a live masterclass with my friend and money mentor, Candy Conant. And now Candy has walked me through the ranks of learning how to track the money coming in and out of my business and to watch for trends. In 17 years, I have had many, an accountant and a bookkeeper 
that I have hired to help me do this in my business, but none of them has taken the step back, met me where I was, and walked me through the process to get comfortable with looking at my numbers, tracking my numbers, and then being able to make smart investments with the money inside of my business. Now that I am more versed in understanding the flow of money in my business and out of my business, I can start looking at things like programs that are going to help me move my business forward, help me become a better mom, and help my kids become better leaders and innovators in the future. So an investment is something that I look at now gladly because I know that every time I invest in a coach or a mentor or programs for my kids, I can see the changes taking place in them. And sometimes we all need somebody looking in from the outside, seeing our superpowers and showing, showing us opening those doors and showing us what's really happening, what they see, because sometimes we're so involved and eyes straight forward in our business, we can often overlook our own personal strengths and attributes that help us become those better business owners and those parents. So I want to know if you have ever invested in yourself in your business or for your kids. Eight weeks ago, I invested in a program and in a coach to help me learn to be better on video. And I do have to say that I think that I have gotten much better on video and it's now become my favorite way to share with all of you. It's my favorite way to share stories of things that I've overcome so that you can be inspired and take action on as well. And it's been such a gift to myself. I, of course, did it for my business. I made it an investment from my business. However, the gifts and the transformations that I've experienced have definitely been in myself, which then flows through to my business. Because now that I'm experiencing so much joy in coming to you live, sharing what we're doing here at Our Young Creators and how we're helping kids see the possibility in themselves as they think about their futures. So let me know in the comments what investments you have made in yourself recently or investments you want to make for yourself going forward. I speak from personal experience because I have spent literally tens of thousands of dollars and I know some of you out there may be cringing at that number. However, every single program, every single mentor, Every single coach that I have invested in has made significant changes, not only in terms of my business, but transform transformations in myself personally. And those transformations, of course, flow through to the business and to my relationships with my kids, my family, as well as all of you. So I would love to gift you my knowledge. All you have to do is tune in live or on the replay or listen to the podcast when all of these videos air. And I would love to be able to hold your hand, hold you accountable, and you may be looking for activities that you and your kids can do together using their devices, which they may be consumed with right now we are teaching kids to use those devices that they're spending hours on already and showing them how to create and serve others. All right, my friends, I wish you an amazing rest of your Wednesday. Cheers. If you're ready to harness the power of technology 
and get your message out into the world in a big way to make the impact you know you were meant to make for yourself, for your business, or with your family, head over to Instagram or Facebook and message me at Our Young Creators and let me know that you're ready to be our next graduate in the upcoming podcast in a weekend class.